Hello there, my name is Felipe Vilela and welcome back to another Data in the Wild episode hosted by Data Mini. Before we begin, don't forget to subscribe to the channel below and click the bell to turn on notifications to be the first to know every time we upload a new video. Today, we will show you how to use advanced filters in MicroStrategy. So, let's go! In this example, I have two reports. Let's use the first one. Let's edit the advanced filter report. And as you can see, we only have two attributes and one metric. Double click on the report filter. The default options that we have is attribute qualification, set qualification, shortcut, and shortcut to a filter. That's not what we want. Let's go back, click cancel, close the report, click no, we don't want to save this report, click tools, my preferences, editors, and then filter. Check show advanced qualification. Once you do that, click OK. Go back to the report, click edit, double click on the report filter, and we have a fifth option add an advanced qualification. Select this new option. Click OK. In the option, we have um, custom expression and we have joint element list. Let's use the second one. In this new window, we can select available attributes. Those are the attributes available in our project. Let's select category and item and put them in the selected attributes area. So category, the same one as this one, and item. Here, okay. And now we can add um, an, uh, the elements from those attributes. We have books, we have four categories, and for items we have 100 places to go while we're still, um, we're still young at heart. If you want to change those elements, we can click on the Edit button and from the available elements, select, for example, Item. And we have the, all those options because those are coming from the database. And that's, that's okay. Uh, let's just use 100 uh, places to go while we're still young at heart. We have now only the category Books with that specific item and with the uh, unit sold. Go to the design view again, double click on the report filter, and let's change to custom expression. And as you can see, we have this empty expression where we can start typing a new apply comparison statement. Okay? So here we use a SQL. So make sure to use a proper SQL because it uses the SQL for your database. Let's use. Um, this expression here, let's create a, a category description equals to books. That's the same thing as adding category to the report and using the qualification. Let's click OK. And um, that's the, uh, the how it, it works. So we have the, the books in here and let's click um, grid view and we only have category with books. Move to page by to make sure that we only have books and we only have books selected. That wraps up today's video on advanced qualification in MicroStrategy. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions or suggestions for future videos, please comment below. Don't forget to subscribe to know when future videos are posted. Thank you for watching.